Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amy and I am here today with a pair eyewear unboxing. So if you have been with me for a little while, you know I got a new pair of glasses. These are from Pair Eyewear and I've been wearing them on my videos and this is the second style that I've tried. The first style that I tried was a little bit too big and so I returned those and then got these. This is the Wanda pair and what's unique about pair eyewear, if you've never heard of them, is that you buy your glasses and then they have these magnets in the corner that you can then put different toppers on so you can change up your look. So I was sitting upstairs this morning and got a notification of a delivery and I saw that it was my pair toppers that have been kind of lost in transit for a little while. So I'm super excited. I decided I would go ahead. I put on something basic and didn't even put like I put eyeliner and mascara on but no color because I wanted I didn't want to skew how these were going to look but I just thought I'd come down here and check them out with you guys so I don't know how long of a video this will be I've never just done pair even when I got some before and I got a lot of toppers I just kind of did that at the beginning of a video but I thought why not I'm I wouldn't mind if I somehow got on Pear's radar and they wanted to sponsor something for me, but I don't think that'll ever happen. So all this stuff that you're going to see, I paid for with my own money and I just really like it. And I was thinking the other day, what was it that first made me wish I could try different glasses? And I think it was Prue on the Great British Baking Show. She always has really great glasses and with my hair going gray white you know all that I just thought why not add some color somewhere else because I don't I haven't colored my hair for six or seven years at this point maybe even longer um, just because these areas were just so hard to keep colored and it just didn't seem worth it to me anymore so so yeah so enough about that let's get started so I did bring down what I already have, which is these glasses, and I got these. So the last time I went to the doctor, the eye doctor, I got two different prescriptions, one for computer usage and one for distance. Because I could have gotten bifocals, I'm sure that's what most people do, but he acted like, and you guys tell me if this is right or not, but he acted like, because I don't need any glasses at all to read, that bifocals might be more annoying than just getting two different prescriptions. I don't know. So anyway, that's what I did. I've got two different prescriptions. These are my computer ones, and which I got before. And then I'll just, since I only got four toppers with these originally, I'll just show them to you again real quick. Or actually, it looks like I got five. I got the black. And, but you see how much that adds just immediately when you put them on. And I did get, okay, so these, there's no lens in these. The lens are only here for these regular toppers. And they've got magnets in the corners. So now I will say, in all transparency, sometimes... If I go to kind of lift this up to put it back on my nose, sometimes I might like put that, you know, pull this up because there's no magnets at the bottom, only in these corners, but I haven't noticed that to be a problem. Now, if I was, heaven forbid, in a car accident or something, this might fly off, but, <laughs> but that's like worst case scenario. All right, and then most of these, I am gonna go over the prices when I show, um, the ones that I got today, but most of them are $25 for the toppers. The glasses, they have the option of getting transition lenses, blue light coating, you know, all the bells and whistles, but I didn't get any of that. 
I paid $54 for this pair of glasses and then I just chose to spend the rest of my money on these toppers and I figure for $54 if, if for some reason they get really scratched or something, I'll just replace them. And I've noticed when my husband got some really nice glasses the last time, he has to be super careful. You, you know, you're supposed to clean them with a wet cloth and blah, blah, blah. I think because all those coatings and stuff either make the lenses soft or easy to scratch or something. So I just said, forget that. I'm just going with the basic. So... Now, if you do, they have sunglass toppers, so those actually do have a lens on them. And I really like those. But again, most of these are $25. There are some that are 30, and maybe the highest you might find is 35. So I figured since I wasn't, I mean, you can spend a lot of money on glasses. And so I just decided that I would rather spend it on the fashion part. So here's the white. And then I've got Barbie hot pink. And I will say they, you can buy the toppers individually, but they do have some curated sets where they've already pieced together some. And I was, I wish that I'd been paying attention because that's a fairly new thing that they've got. And I wish I'd been paying attention because I think each one of these singles that I got are in separate sets. So it's like I eliminated several sets that I could buy because I've already bought one of the set. So I wish I'd have been paying attention to that. And then I've been wearing these a lot. I really like, I've gotten a lot of compliments on the blue. Okay, so those are the ones I already had. And like I said, or maybe I didn't say, they come in, if you get a pair of glasses, you get one of these cases. You could stick, uh, it's kind of like leather, fake leather, whatever. So it's soft in here. So you could stick some, a topper, maybe two in here. And then your glasses in here. And it does come with a cleaning cloth uh, to go with it. Or you can even just stick a bunch of toppers in here. And then it's got a magnetic closure. I will say I'm looking for a kind of a decorative box that I can sit on my table, my bedside table that I can just put all these in that'll be safe enough that they won't get scratched. So, all right. Now for, so this is what came in the mail today and it's got great packaging and I won't show you the other side because that's got my address on it. And then it comes nicely packaged. So it's got, it's got some filler stuff in here. And then let me get rid of that. And then, ooh, sorry, this stuff's gonna go everywhere if I don't throw it away right now. So I got another case like this because I ordered another pair of glasses with the distance prescription in them. And then your toppers come in these boxes. So these boxes, I think they, they've put as many as six toppers in one box before, but really only about four fit in here at a time. And then, oops, some more throwaways. And then packing slip. So let me set these over here. And oh, this doesn't have the price on it, really? Okay, well, I will pull up my order then on my phone. I don't know why I'm doing that, except in case you want to know which ones are considered premium, I guess, but they've always got special collections. So for example, uh, they have a July 4th collection right now that is going to be leaving pretty soon. They just added a Mickey and Friends collection, so a lot of Mickey Mouse and that kind of stuff. They've got sports teams, Star Wars, 
Marvel, DC Comics. They did a Pride collection for the month of June. Uh, they're just always adding, they've got a Frida Kahlo, I don't ever know if it's Kahlo or Kalo collection, which th that one has some really cool things in it. But okay, let's get to my orders. And I hope I can look at a receipt. Oh, well, this will tell me this has got all the prices. Now they do, there's almost always coupons that you can find somewhere. There's the code new pair that you can use to get five or $6 off of a pair of glasses. I think it's $6 off. And then I have a referral code, which they, everybody can get a referral code. As soon as you order something from them, you can get a code to share with your friends. So that's what I've got below. And I don't remember what that deal is, but you'll see it down below. So if for some reason, <laughs> you want to give pair a try, please use my code because then we both get something out of the deal. And then they also have a, as you're purchasing things, you're earning a point for every dollar you spend. And then once you get so many points, you can exchange it for free toppers. So some of what I got in this order would have been free because I think I had and I don't know how this works because I returned all the stuff I got before, but for some reason I feel like I still had the the discount from that or the points earned from that. And maybe that's because when I did a return, I put the money back in my credit for a pair instead of getting an actual refund. So maybe that's why. But anyway, all right, so in here, this is how the cloth comes in a little Ziploc bag. And you can also get like a warranty on your glasses too, you know, in case of damage. I didn't do that either. So, okay, so because I wanted to always know which one were my computer ones and which one were my distance ones, I ordered the distance ones in black. So you guys are blurry now, but when I look over here, it's very clear. And I will say when you order, if you've never ordered glasses online before, you will be given the, a, a way to submit your prescription if you have a written, you know, a piece of paper with your prescription on it. You can also, I think, have them contact your doctor if for some reason you don't have it. And then there's also what's called a PD distance, I think. And if your prescription is missing that piece of information, they will have you in the app or yeah, in the app. I'm, I ordered from the app. So yeah, I think it's in the app. They'll have you turn, you know, give access to the app to your camera and then they'll tell you to hold up a credit card over your eyebrows and then they'll, that's how they'll measure it. So that's what I've done both times I've ordered and I think it's been okay. So like I every it, it seems okay. <laughs> so that's how that kind of process works. So anyway, so here are the black glasses. And like I said, I got the Wanda and I did specifically get the same style in both because that way I can use the toppers, you know, regardless. But most likely I will keep these in my van with my sun toppers uh, for when I'm driving. So, all right, so there are those. And they feel light to me. They're, they're maybe a little bit heavier than my, the glasses that I used to wear, which were more of a wire metal kind of glasses. And they, at least, I my guess is that all of them kind of are like this, but this is the nose piece. So if you need an actual nose piece, you might have an issue with this. And I will say I get, my face gets greasy. And so as the day wears on, these slip around a little bit more than, than not. But I have that problem with every glass, every pair of glasses that I ever get, whether it's got a real nose piece or one of these resin kind of 
um, nose pieces. So that's just something to keep in mind, but they really are overall very light. And I think if you wanted to, if you just want the frame, because you like the idea of switching out your colors, you could probably just, I know you can buy it with just no prescription in the lens, and then you could pop them out and put your own lenses in, or if you're just doing it for fashion, just get the ones with no prescription, and then you've got, that way you've got the frame that you can, um, you know, be fashionable. And they've got different styles. So the ones that I got before these were kind of the same cat eye style, but they were super big. And so I never had any eyebrows when I would look at it. And for some reason that just bugged the heck out of me. So I returned those and got these, which were a little bit smaller, but they do have, they don't have any like I used to wear, which were more of a, like an Ashley Banfield kind of thin, thin style, but they do have a variety. So if you don't like this kind, they might have a kind that you like, but I really like these. So I paid $54 because like I said, you can get $6 off of a pair of glasses and let's see which ones they put some, they put some of the toppers in here with it. Okay. Let me do the, I got another pair of the sunglass toppers and this one is rose gold sparkle. So I really like these. They did have a sparkle set of four, which is I believe what I got that had this in it. And I apologize because on my invoice, it does not say how much that set cost but it's usually a little bit cheaper to buy the set than each of them individually. So this is the Rose Gold Sparkle Sun Top. And it's showing me that I paid $25.42 for this pair. So I think that means it's originally 30. And they give you a special thing for those. And then I got navy blue so that you know that is a good look my husband decided that he prefers the ones that are just solid colors more traditional I don't know but I do have some in here that are not just solid colors but I got this there was a classic set that had some of the darker single colored ones in it. And this was in that, so navy blue. And I'll point that out when I get to another one. But this, well, this one's called The Navy for $21.25 from the Classic Collection. And then this one's from the Star Wars Collection. I did get this one before in the bigger ones. So if you saw that video, you might remember these. But this has got Princess Leia in the corner. But what I really liked about this one was the colors. So I've got a rose red shirt that I like to wear with a white sweater. So I just thought this would be a good match for that. And I like this one because it's pretty symmetrical. Some of the designs that they have are not symmetrical. So if if that's a thing for you, then you know, you'll stay away from that. But this was a pretty good, it's not exactly symmetrical, but it's pretty close. So yeah, so I, and I'm not sure you'd really know it was Princess Leia unless you were standing right in front of me. But yeah, so I really like those. And that cost $30. So a lot of times these special collections like that that they've licensed are gonna be a little bit more. All right, so now to a box. All right, this next one is, was also in that classic collection with the Navy. This one is the Spruce. 
So a nice darker green. They have a ton of different greens and I'll probably probably be getting some of those at some point, but I got this one because it's just a good green. Well, and it was in the set, right? And I was trying to save some money. So this one was $21.25. And then this one, I believe I just got by itself. This one is the grape and it's $25. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to wearing, to wearing these, right? And with my different outfits. So when, before I placed this order, I took some of my Timu outfits out of the closet and I'm like, okay, let's see what I can find to go with these. This next one, I also bought by itself. And this one is the Army Green. Because I really love the olive and army green colors. They do have a camouflage one, but then I thought not all camouflage greens are the same. So I just thought maybe getting this one would hopefully work with all of those, unless it's more of a teal. Some, I've got some camouflage pants. It's kind of more on the bluish green side, which is a little weird, but so the army green and that one was 25. And then this one is in the July 4th collection called the Neapolitan Gradient. And that one is also 25. So this one's a gradient, right? But they do have some that are splits to where it's half of one thing and half of another. I don't know that I got any of those, but but yeah, so I thought this one, this one would probably look good with uh, a shirt that I hauled in a Timu haul recently that I'm going to be wearing backwards because it's a little bit too low in the front and it's kind of a v-neck, so I was wearing it backwards. But it's kind of got the browns and, and um, pinky colors in it, so I might wear this with that. But this was 25 if I didn't say. All right. All right, this one. Okay, this one's got one in a special kind of thing. So I guess we'll see what, what that one is. All right, this next one, I believe I bought by itself and it was the red. You all, everybody needs a Sally Jesse Raphael pair of glasses in their collection. But this one I'll probably be wearing coming up for July 4th. I've got a video I'm planning to do for that. So I'll probably wear these for that. But the red and they were 25. And then this one is the ocean blue. For 25 so again another gradient one I really like this I really am liking the blue ones so maybe it's because blue is complementary to peach and and my skin is very peachy reddish pe peachy so so yeah I really like these and those were 25 and then the special pair Oh yes, okay, what is this one called? Silver Fractals, this was a $30 one. So this one must be more prone to scratching maybe. Look at that. <laughs> this one's great for my hair, right? <laughs> so yeah, so. They do have some kind of mother of pearl looking ones that I thought about getting, which would kind of be similar to this um, in the, the shine and dimension of it. But yeah, so $30 for these. I'll put them back in the thing. So we got two more boxes and then we're done.
I'll tell you what, it's funny when us haulers do things like this and they're not sponsored. It's like free advertising, right? All right, this next one is another one that was part of the, sorry, I have an itch in my nose. It was part of the sparkle set that I got. This one is the Ruby Sparkle. Yeah, that's great. I love that. So that one cost $21.19 because it was part of the set. So I just need some Ruby slippers, right? But yeah, that's a great, I love that one. And then this one is also from the Sparkle set. This one is the Champagne Sparkle. So this one maybe not quite as great for me because it's warm and I probably look better in cool colors, but I still, I still like this and I'll find something to wear with this, right? But this one was $21.20. And then the final one in the sparkle set, because there were four, is the black sparkle. So yeah, that one's good too. This one will be great with those dark gray uh, t-shirts that I have that are kind of, you know, heathery looking. So this will go great with any of those. Well, anything really, but especially. And with my gray holy sweater, I think will look good with this. And this one was $21.19. And then this one was in the basic set that I got, and this one is the burgundy. So that one is 20, well, it was 21, 25 since it was part of the set. Burgundy used to be my fa absolute favorite color, and I used to wear burgundy clothes all the time. I, had, I don't wear as many of them now as I used to, partly because, um, well, I don't know why. But yeah, I really do like burgundy. All right, and then the last box. All right, this one is the black cheetah and it was 25. So I like this too, and this is another gradient one. So I don't, I don't think I got any of the splits, but I really like this. They, in one of their ads, they had another kind of gray leopard print that I really wanted, but they don't carry it anymore. So that's one thing that when they do their special collections, I think what I decided to do is wait till I get the email saying the special collection will be leaving soon and then I'll get whatever was in it that I want to get. I mean, it's not any cheaper then. But I don't know, that's just kind of the way I guess I decided I'd work the system. <laughs> but this one will be great with any kind of gray or black or leopard, cheetah, 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 black cheetah, $25. All right, this one came in the classic set. So now I'm thinking maybe I told you something came in the classic that didn't, but I'm pretty sure this one did. This one is the teal to espresso gradient. So I kind of, I like this one too. I've, and I've got some clothes that'll go with this one. Specifically, I was looking for, sorry, I feel like I'm going to sneeze now. <laughs> I was looking for things to go with my boho dresses from Timu because they're kind of wild sometimes, and I thought that would be an easy thing to say, okay, I wear this dress and with this topper. But yeah, these are, these are nice. And this one, because it was in the set, was $21.25. And then this next one I bought on its own. This next one is the Shoreline for $25. So this one's a little different. I got this because it kind of goes with one of my dresses, but... If I can get this a little bit closer and you can tell so when you look at something like this this is a printing company really that just happens to sell glasses 
So you can kind of see the water and then the beach at the bottom and, and whatnot. And so my guess is that every one is just a smidge different and it's not exactly symmetrical, but I'm okay with it. But if you're looking for certain colors, you may find things like this that you wouldn't necessarily think to buy. But if you're looking for colors like, oh, well, those colors at least go with it, with whatever I'm trying to match. So, so yeah. And then this one was $25. And then last is probably the wildest one in this order. And it... I think this one might have been in the, it was either in the July 4th one uh, collection or the Pride collection. This one is the Fashion Stripes for $25. <laughs> so I could probably wear this with my Timu flower child dress that I got. It's just kind of waves of pink and yellow. But yeah, so this one is a little more out there, right? So my husband doesn't really like this one, but I think it's great. <laughs> so, so yeah, so there, there's all of the ones that I got in my haul. <laughs> and really you just store them stacked like this. I mean, or you could get a, I don't know, they may be curved a little bit too much. I was thinking about getting kind of a magnet sheet bulletin board kind of thing that I could just stick them on but I'll probably just find a plush lined box or something that I can put these in just to keep them from getting dusty and that kind of thing but cleaning them you use your cleaning cloth you can obviously use um, a gentle soap and water these are not very thick and you just would you would clean these the same way but you just want to be careful you don't want to scratch them and so far they've all stuck i mean technically <laughs> technically i think i can i'll put them all on there <laughs> so that's super heavy but um but yeah, so there we have it. There is my pair unboxing. Thank you so much for watching. If you were at all interested in trying out pair for yourself, be sure to check the description below and get my referral code. You can also Google pair eyewear coupons. There's tons of them on Facebook, so my, mine's not the only one, but that would be sweet if you did use mine. And I think, so one thing I want to address here is my giveaways. So I want to continue doing my giveaways, but some people felt like it was misleading for me to put giveaway in the title of my videos because I'm not giving away something that relates to the haul per se. So like if I had put giveaway on the title for this video, people would watch only because they thought I was giving away pair, some kind of pair eyewear thing. And so they didn't feel like that was a very good thing for me to do so but I do still want to give things away from my Etsy shop because that is supporting a cause near and dear to my heart and so I will continue to put information in my description below about a giveaway so if you ever see that I will put the giveaway word keyword in there and a link to the item that I'm giving away so if you are a crafter I mean, pretty much probably only crafters would be interested in this or journalers or that kind of thing. But if you're, if that's something you're interested in, always be sure to check my descriptions below for, there will be a giveaway section. And that way I'm not just shamelessly plugging and putting giveaway in my title just to get the views, even though it would be nice to get the views, but that's okay. I don't need to get them that way. I get them just because you guys are awesome people and you like supporting your small town hauler. <laughs> so, so there's that. And I'll try to say that little blurb on a few of my other videos since I know not everybody watches these non Timu ones. But I've enjoyed showing you that and I'm looking forward to wearing the different ones in different future videos for you guys. And 
I just thank you so much for supporting this channel. So wherever you are, whenever you are, I hope you're having a great day. And until we meet again, please take care of yourself. Bye.